Welcome back, everyone. Uh, we are continuing on our quest, the overall quest, obviously, to Deity, but right now we're trying uh, Emperor. We've got the Romans here. We've randomly selected our terrain, and we got Shuffle. So there's a lot of land, a lot of water. Don't know what to expect. I think this is more interesting. Um, we started our capital of Reuben here. Our next city was Jillian G, and then Sour Patch. Um, our one of our next goals is to take over La Venta. Uh, we want to take this over so we can build this wonder here that allows a lot of bonuses for lakes and things like that. So that's our next goal. Um, feel free to chime in on the chat um, if you have any specific things that you want to build or you have any questions. Um, I'm going to try to make this sort of like a tutorial to try to show people how to get better. Uh, lots of tricks that I've learned. I've progressed up to uh, Emperor at this point. I haven't won on Emperor, but I've won on everything below that. I've also probably lost on everything below that, so you got to start somewhere. This game's a little bit different than previous civilizations. Um, it's got a lot more layers, a lot more things to look at. You can't just focus on one thing. You have to keep widespread and everything building. And one of my goals is to build enough cities that my production is 40% higher so basically 40% more cities than everybody else um, so I'm gonna probably push towards expanding quite a bit um, definitely want to make sure that nobody gets stronger than me militarily uh, right now Greece is extremely strong and they're sending a lot of scouts around here so we gotta beware uh, beware Greece um, so I'm going to dive right in, but I'm sure at some point I'll catch you up on where we're at. Production. We just finished Ancient Walls. That was just a quick fix in case that ship comes back so we can shoot him away. Um, let's see. We need, we need more settlers. We probably need more builders. They're both extremely cheap, only four or five turns each. We need uh, more military. I really want spearmen. But archers are gonna be good. Let's go with let's go with archer, builder, seller. I like this cube system so you can pick the next couple different uh, next couple things to build. Alright. This scout this scout is basically run out of areas to look at. Um, but you know, you'll kinda of poke around here. I could automate him. But it's still kind of early. I, I want to make sure I don't accidentally lose him, like run him right into the ground. Um, so let's try here. Probably can't explore too much further in this direction. This warrior was heading back. I wanted to upgrade him to a legion. These legions are extremely powerful. I'm going to need him to tank for me when I attack La Venta. Next turn, scout, man Madal. don't want to attack them. I could cut through here, let's do that. Let's see what else is there. You never know what uh, extra villages we might be able to discover, what extra discoveries we could make. Uh, Archer, we want to head him over in this direction. I'm not at war anymore. I don't have any barbarians. They have a lot of catapults and things like that. Yeah, swordsmen. So I definitely want to, don't want to start attacking right away. I need more military. But I'm going to kind of set up around here and see if maybe they start a war with Brazil and the timing's right, like they have a lot fewer units, and I could try to move in. We'll see. They're going to be building wonders a lot faster. That's one of the advantages. They have bonuses towards production, so they can get their things built a lot quicker than us. I'm not going to focus on wonders. Uh, if I'm going to take a wonder, it's by taking cities. Like Oracle is down in St. Petersburg, you know, things like that. It's going to be slightly different than building it on my own. Lovely military. Yeah, my military is not strong right this second. 
All right, civic can be maximized if I get two campus districts. Do I have two campus districts happening soon? That one's going to be done soon. Uh, let's go ahead and switch. Because we want the bonus and we'd just be wasting our time if we did something else. So let's go ahead and switch. Let's so defensive tactics. It's going to be good for defense. Theology. Theology might be important because this is a non-military type of way it, you can gain power. You can gain, uh, there's definitely advantages to, to holy sites and things like that. I don't have any right now, but in the long term that might be a good thing. Let's swap over there. Uh-oh. Huey Te Teo Kali from Gorjo. Wow, so they built the wonder I was going to build. That is a shame. I can still take over these lake things and then take it, take over from them. But that's not going to be easy at this point. They're kind of far away. Greece is way over here. We get some ships maybe. Alright, so this kills that plan. Ah, makes me not as interested in attacking Laventa. Military is useful, you're smarter than the enemy, you know when to heal, you know when to run away, things like that, but I'm not exactly hmm, kind of nervous about that one. Alright, well, change is planned. This is definitely going to be an uphill battle, but uh, I'm, I'm up for it, I definitely want to get there. We could take over a settler if we go here. Taking over a settler from Samaria would definitely make them upset. Uh, I would take it over, but I would just get attacked by somebody. They probably yeah, they have a suzerain here with non Madal. That's not gonna work, because if I take it over, they'll attack me and then I'll be dead. And I'll lose my settler. So that is tempting. If they had a settler maybe closer to me, I might do that, but Unfortunately, not a good time to do that. Exploring. Zanzibar. Oh, I discovered another place. No suzerain for them, that's good. This is my trader, he was heading over to Buenos Aires. That would build a road there, which is very useful. I'll help my units get on there faster. Another reason to do that. Mathematics, there's nothing you can do. Everything around you is mathematics. Everything around you is numbers. No place to do that, but. Looks like I'm cornered in here. Let's check this out if I can sneak out the back way. Here's my archer I just built. Definitely going to need that. Prefer to have a crossbow. How are we doing for crossbows? Crossbows. Crossbows are way over here in machinery. I need the wheel, engineering, and machinery. Wow. Find a natural wonder for two turns. Let's get this out of the way. 
and then let's hold down shift and hit that one and make that one the second one. Or with Celestial Navigation, that can build my harbor. Let's cancel this one. Astrology. It's already boosted. It's definitely worth it. Maybe with my uh, builder that I'm working on, you could mine the resource to beat that up. So I definitely want to look for a resource. They want me to start a war. I already did, so I just need to go. Buzz off. Here's our scout exploring. believe in astrology. I'm a Sagittarius and we're skeptical. Archers get the builder. I really want a resource. Do I have any resources that I can mine? That would be... Here's a luxury resource. I could go repair this. This is one of the things I want to do. I also need quarry. I need all of these things. Let's work this. Pearls, that's a resource. Then the rice, and then the stone. Here's my other legion. He needs to go right there. Starting a library over there. Got my archer in place. Glad there haven't been too many barbarians lately. Oh, speaking of the devil. Look at that. We have a quadrine. Quadramine. Quadr. Whatever. Call him a quad. So I click here and then I can attack him. That's a major victory. Click here, I can attack him. Alright, Reuben. Two attacks, so I just need one more. He'll probably run away, but if he doesn't, one of the reasons to get rid of them is they like to come around here and plunder your resources. Glad I built that encampment there. Is mining a resource? No, it is a resource, but it's not a mine. Russia's already in Renaissance. Oh boy. That was nice. 
set your course by the stars, Celestial navigation not now by the lights of every passing ship. this resource and immediately the barbarians came to steal it from and I don't know what I can do about that I don't have enough power it freezes on the water of course it does except to not get distracted by everyone else going circles around me this early all right so I got those two things um, Oh, land units can't even embark yet until I get shipbuilding. That's another thing. So, we need machinery in the worst way. Let's go with wheel engineering machinery for now. We also need this over here in the industrial zone. Let's go for these three. Progress, right? Improvement, pillage, Reuben, closed by barbarians. Nothing I can do about that at this point. They probably took pearls and because it was fishing next to the uh, heel button or something. Okay, and then near the tundra. Not the most exciting places, but. Alright, now we can move in. Extra settler. Hmm, now we have to figure out a place for it. Well, let's see what we're going to build next. Uh, we could build a galley and start exploring. That's probably a good thing to do. We could build more military. It's encampment training. We could build another settler. Yeah, we're going to have to settle here, forward settle these guys. I know it won't make them happy to feel closer to them, but they don't have much of a military. Hopefully my defense can handle them. You gotta do what you gotta do. So I need to probably build one or two more cities in this area. That'll be the next spot. We'll, we'll zoom in and I'll let you guys pick. I'll say, you know, A here, B here. We'll kind of decide where we want to go. Um, I said I wanted to build I kinda want another settler. Let's just go for it. It's dangerous. These places are mostly tundra. Um, I don't know why they want me to build a city there. These are I think they're called dead tiles. There's not a whole lot going on in there. Um, this settler needs to move to a spot. What do we like? We got on the coast, we got stone. These look like desert. Yeah, they're desert. If we built on desert, that eats up one of the bad tiles. 
This one's close to horses. We might be able to steal that from the Russians, but they're probably going to go for that to expand to. So that's going to be tricky. We got marble here, but that's one, two, three. So that's worth taking right here. Mountains are good. This is a close spot, so it has a lot of overlap with Jillian, but it's really close to a lot of good stuff. It's got cattle, it's got marble, it's got wine, it's got a mountain if we want to build like a uh, campus right here, or a holy site around here. Let's see, if we build a campus here, that's just a wood, so we could chop and then build that. So, let's look at possibilities. So I'm going to put pins in here. We'll call this one right here that's close by A, and then we'll see what else we can go. We could also go, oh we need to go by water, because then we get additional housing if we do that. So how about, oh if we build here, we can still lock in all these things, but we're also closer to uh, gaining land. This might be tempting them a little, but let's go ahead and put this. I'll call this one B. It's a little more forward than the other ones, but it's on water, so there's additional advantages of that. And let's look down here if there's anything interesting. There's no fresh water, but there's... Um, here we are one away from sh sheep, marble, and cattle. Again, no fresh water, but uh, we're definitely closer to other resources. We're close to this. We could do an aqueduct here and get steel water from this lake. So we could actually make up for it not having it. And we got mountains down here. So this is also another one. If we build here and here, so let's call this one C. So what does the chat think? Do they like A, B, or C for my next city? That's true, I could aqueduct here if I built here. Let's do that. Let's do B and then later C. I like that idea. I'll leave these two on. That saves us the time. We don't have to build the alphabet. This doesn't count, so build two. You still have two. Yep. So that didn't hurt, and I can still build two more. I can still do the. Uh... In fact, I should do the fish. I should repair that, and then do the stone, just for distance reasons. Got another envoy. We still have the plus one if you have from zero to one. So. Let's go ahead, let's see what we got as far as options. Zanzibar is pretty far, I don't see that happening anytime soon. Laventa has no suzerain, um, but I was going to attack them soon. <laughs> Not as excited now that I can't get Huey Toakelia up, but uh, let's build progress towards Kumasi. If we can steal this from them, that'll help us. They had this little thing called a fort. Build improvement Roman fort plus four defensive strength for occupying unit. Fortification bonus applied to occupying unit. Wow. That's tempting. I don't want to do it right this second, but. Once I develop a war with them, maybe they will help out. Really need those crossbows if we're going to do that. 
Alright, so if we have a Legion, and he's just going to get range attacked here. I don't think that's going to happen. Still mate if I attack the minor victory. So my archers are pretty pathetic. Two legions. So the legions are really what's going to do it for me. About ten legions. Oh, major victory archers. Okay, so archers against here are good. So basically, I need to move my archers out of the way and legions in the bulk of the fight. I'm just checking the major victories here. So that would be a major victory. They're going to attack me and the forts. Do I have any other military coming? I think it's now or never. It's not perfect, but I think you got to do what you got to do. here. So I used my two free attacks, now I'm going to just take over this spot. Still a major, major victory here. I want to get out all these ranged units because they're obnoxious. <laughs> Got it, okay. Yeah, cross our fingers here. I definitely would prefer to move back and then attack, but uh, I already used up my movement points, so. I'm just gonna leave my units around the city and hope that they attack them and we get defensive bonuses for the most part. We can no more have exact religious thinking without theology than exact mensuration and astronomy without mathematics or exact iron making without chemistry. Finished our bonus for recorded history. This is exactly what we were hoping for. Now we can bump in, knock it in, one turn, bullseye. So if they didn't attack us, they moved into a more defensive position. See, this is what we humans are smarter than that. Uh... So I'm going to do my free attack here. Free attack here. Horseman can get promoted, so he got attacked. So I could attack them, but it'd be a minor defeat. But if we take a promotion, combat strength versus attacking ranged, anti-cavalry. Um, the healing is definitely one of the big reasons here. Look at this, the Legion can just crush the swordsman. definitely progressing towards Laventa. It seems to have worked out so far. Some of these movements will be heals in the near future. I'll also see if I can move on those four things that I was thinking of. I don't know if I can do it within their base or not, but I'm going to be sitting there, might as well. Alright, so we got our campus done. We could build a walls here for defense on this side. We could build a granary to help expand. Let's see how we're doing in size. We got six housing. Uh, 
let's do let's do ancient walls. Um, it's good to have defense back here. I don't have a lot of units at the moment. So having if ships come around here, giving another hit or two on them, definitely. And I'm going to be doing some building around here. So having the builders kind of cover their backs. And we got another envoy. Good to know. I'll definitely keep that in mind. Alright, where are we going to build our envoy? Let's go ahead and if we take this, this will give us bonus culture, but we don't have any theater districts. Let's not waste our time with Laventa. Non Medal would be good to start paying eventually. Policy change. Oh, okay, so we now have bonuses to. Ah, okay. So we could swap out the. Where was the campus bonus? Thought we had a campus bonus in here. My eyes are playing tricks on me. We should have one. Okay, holy site adjacency bonus. So it's not exactly it. We're not quite there yet. Maybe next turn. Okay, well, I think we're building a settler, so we'll just keep it. Yeah, we'll keep it as is for the moment. We'll definitely change soon. To my border, I've lived through some terrible things in my life, now we can do the some of which actually happened. Uh, uh, campuses, like I was thinking. We only have one option here. Okay. Um, and government wise, we can change policies. So, campus district bonuses. Campus is key. Technology is always important, so you have to remember with that. Let's go east. Alright, this guy's injured. Probably start out with here. He's gonna do a lot more damage. But oh, he's blocked by the trees. Let's see if we can finish that off. Yes, Ooh, they have a crossbow. These are gonna be tricky. Must be only certain places I can build on port thing. I can plunder, and this will yield health. Um, that's definitely going to be useful eventually. But I'm going to fortify it until healed, because he needs to be healed anyway. Horse can go to here. Go to this mine. Legion can, if I plunder, I get 50 health, so these are really helpful having farms right around for me to hit, so I got lucky with this one. Let's see. And this attack from here, I don't know, we'll see next turn. I hope it can, if it can't then it's going to be a long battle. You might move to the trees and attack from there to Leventum. We'll see. Cross my fingers. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We lost our injured 
archer back here. Shucks. Minus three on defenses. Oh boy. This might be a long battle. Yep, this is going to be a long battle. Our archers are almost useless against Leventa. They're just going to keep flying away with this crossbow here. Hmm. Peace is not possible for another seven turns. Sheesh. That was a bad idea. Eh, live and learn. You can make mistakes. Major defeat. Um, the good thing is, shields don't really replenish themselves quickly. Unfortunately, they have like every possible bonus on their attacks. They're just gonna keep range attacking me. Let's just keep plowing away. If I pillage, I get gold. I'll take what I can get, right? got a swordsman coming in to attack me. Luckily I can heal myself so they, they're probably just going to start plundering me and beat me up just I'll we'll keep my builder alive just so you can get through. Don't reinvent the wheel. Just realign it. to promote him. Let's go to the trees. If I go to the trees and I can promote. Get some meal. Not sure how this is going to turn out. Horseman to the rescue. <laughs> if I go to here and then attack him, then I'll still be in here if he attacks me. If I go this way, he could sneak around. But... <laughs> They're going to give me one for open borders. It's free money, I suppose. <laughs> hey, they took their uh, crossbow out. That's good. Out of their base. Maybe I can kill it. Trader. Alright. Who wanted a trade route? Kumasi did. Gives me culture and gold, plus a road. Major victory if I attack this with my horsemen. protection I gotta run away first. They can attack me but they don't think they can take me over. There's a certain type of unit, I don't know, like the raiders or something like that that can actually take me over. Archer. 
orchard destroyed by the city center. Ouch. So I don't think I have any archers left. Yep, I lost my archers. Man, archers are useless. I just, I should have just waited until crossbows. Crossbows are so much fun. There's no reason to hang out here anymore. Let's get your guys over here where I'm starting my scene. That and get some bonuses. Sumeria with a horseman. Uh oh. I've played before and Sumeria builds up a lot of units near your base. That means they're poised to attack you. Uh, yikes. So I got one move left. Should you go hide in the city? Yeah, because I have a horseman and a quadri here. Next settler, he was going to come down here. All right, next city. You know what that means? That means we've got to rename it. Let's see what the number four city is going to be. Do, 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 do. This is all randomized friends, subscribers. Parent, lawyer, 28. Hmm. Okay. Start with the right letter. And I said. I said let's take off the numbers, so I'll just stick with that. And production wise, we are close to the enemy, I think, close to the Russians, they're not the enemy at the moment, but I think starting out with walls is probably a good thing. We'll get a builder down here quickly to help clean up some of this land. Then we got our settler. We need builders. Let's go ahead and get some more builders. Julia needs walls down here too. Let's put that on the queue before we can get. We have granary, that's important. Archer is important, but let's stick the walls in there. Legion 
was thinking about attacking here, then healing. Ooh, promoting for your promotion. We'll take it. Horseman has extra movements after pillaging. That's pretty awesome. He could really go for... Nah, because if he goes here, he'll get attacked. Sorry, you're just going to have to go and heal on your own slowly. We're catching up in military. We're just about as strong as Russia and Brazil. Can't give up. He was hiding. He was going to come over here and heal this. Or repair it. <laughs> Your people settled too close. You should consider seeking land elsewhere. I'm about to build another place, so I don't want to make any promise. Vilnius, so I've discovered another city state. Horseman. I had a settler coming down here. Let's go ahead and have him help out over here just in case he's moving. Let's take the sink route farther away from the emotions. Last thing we need is to lose another unit. I was going to pillage. I definitely think a promotion's good. But I'll pillage while I'm here and I can go promote later. Or I could promote and then pillage. Well, what does the promotion give? Defending against range attacks, melee strength. That's so powerful, and then that way the attack me hurts them more. That is for powerful regions, good. Alright. I can condemn the heretic on this page. I don't want to start another war with Brazil or something like that. That's not going to happen. One more turn. So next turn, I'll be able to do peace with them. because I broke my borders and having units on there. Oh, oh, well, that was like, let me see through. I don't think we're going to make it over there. I was hoping to uh, plunder that mine, but oh, I hope this guy's not trapped. Well, I'm going to have to wait one more turn. I want to plunder again and then run away. Production too low. Production too low. That's a weird reason to hate somebody. Denounced. The Russians denounced me. Despicable me. He's mad because I denounced them. So that means no Normal way. people believe that Doesn't if it ain't broke, don't fix it. Engineers believe that if it ain't broke, it doesn't have enough features yet. Alright, finally. The horseman comes back alive. Go here. Oh, can't plunder it yet. Alright, after I plunder it, then I will make peace. Okay, I've plundered enough places. I can run away. I'm not such a coward.
Brazil's not happy with me. Everybody's going to denounce me. Yeah, I know. And Invincibility okay. lies in the defense. The possibility of victory in the attack. Can't miss this. Look at that. Bam. Gone. Finally, that pesky boat is gone. Sunk. Feudalism is huge. Um, this allows bonuses if you build a farm next to another farm. So, I don't have the land for it, but if I start chopping down some trees, I can get some more grassland and get that. Yeah. Feudalism is one of the key ones to get. Definitely useful. Alright. Build another builder. Do we have any more districts to build? No, we can just build expansions on the current districts. No, we need more military. Let's get into another legion. Well, no, let's get another archer. This will turn it, we'll upgrade it to a cross. Alright, let's get south or east? A lot more interesting places to have a lot better places to build cities for me and for them. Okay, so this builder is paired up. Um, I said I was going to build stone, mine the stone, quarry the stone. Do we have any places we can mine? We still need that mine. Of course not. It's just a weird map today. I'm like stuck on this like weird attachment onto the mainland. There we go. Pillage gives me gold. Then let's say peace out. Declared peace. So I plundered a lot. It's something. Got a lot of gold now. Definitely move towards that. And with that, I think it's probably time to wrap up this round. Definitely, we tried attacking Levento, we tried attacking Russia. Not nearly enough power, uh, especially at the <clears throat> ranged units. Should have done crossbows on both. I think that would have made a big difference. Um, Russia was kind of a surprise. Leventa, we did some progress with getting plundered, but they took all our archers. So I call that one kind of a stalemate, um, a learning process. We'll definitely take what we can get. When you lose, you don't lose everything, you still gain experience. So that makes it so the next time you can do that much better. So I'm definitely looking forward to getting that. Um, with that, I'm going to pause right here Let's see where we're at. and I'll be back in a moment thank you <laughs>